plaintiff, Jordan Truesdale, met the defendant in high school, and years later they reconnected and casually dated. However, Jordan's suing the defendant because he jumped on her car and dented the hood. Defendant Charles Bowler admits that while he was seeing Jordan, he was still seeing his ex, and that caused a lot of problems. Charles admits that he sat on Jordan's car, but insists it wasn't an issue until months later. Start with you. Well, I met the defendant um, years ago, like I was in high school and had a lot of potential. He was running this concert series and I was blogging about music. So we built this friendship. Um, we fell out of touch and then um, he started to like reach out to me via social media and- What school did you all go to? Oh, we didn't meet in our high school. We went, it was just around the time we were in high school. Got it. Go ahead. Um, but yeah, he would reach out to me on social media and like ask me to go out and help him with his music. And I was just like, you know, no, I'm good. Um, but then I was like, all right, you know, he started to apologize for what happened and just be like, you know, I'm a different person. I'm trying to be a better person now. You know, let's just talk, blah, blah, blah. So I gave him the time of day, um, took me to this nice restaurant and we were actually having a good time. So I'm like, okay, you know, maybe this will be all right. Um, so we're just friends dating. And then like, I think a day after we went out on this date, he's like, hey, i am be honest, this girl's gonna contact you. Um, she like sent me this message with your, your phone number. And I'm like, uh, you know, I thought you had an ex that was an ex and that's it. Um, doesn't really matter to me. We've went on one date at this point. Let me get some background from you. Uh, well, most of what she said was right. Uh, the day before we went on that date, what prompted me to ask her on the day is I was on a date with the girl she's speaking of and I saw her out. Uh, she looked nice, so the next day I hit her up, uh, asked her to go on a date with me. And, I mean, most of what she said was true. Okay, what about the music she was saying? Oh yeah, I mean, that's true as well. I mean, uh, I did used to do music. I threw shows and stuff, and like she said, she blogged. So we had a mutual connection on there. So we did Some work. Concerts or parties? Uh, concerts. What city? Uh, Detroit, downtown Detroit, Detroit, St. Andrews. Okay, St. Andrews, would it fit about a thousand people? Mm -hmm. You were successful? Yeah, it? I did capacity a couple of times. So Eminem started, right? Mm -hmm. Correct. I used to go there, in young days. Who would right. you see? Who would you see? I was, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> I was about 19 or so. Uh -huh. <laughs> All right, why are you suing him, ma'am? Well, Your Honor, um, as I said, like we were hanging out and uh, he doesn't have a car. So I was dropping him off at home one day and we're, you know, just chilling. And he decides to jump onto my car like it's a jungle gym and left a few dents in my hood. Where were and you I, all at? We were at his house. Okay. Um. Yeah, so there's dents in my car and I have a lease. So like I'm obligated to, you know, turn my car in in pristine condition. So he's like, don't worry about it. I'm gonna pay for it, you know. But as our friendship progressed, I started to tell like, he doesn't have a lot of integrity. Like his word, it means what it means in that moment. So um, I'm like, hey, you're gonna have to sign an agreement because Good. I literally like, I have to you pay have it for today? this, it's costing me money. I do. All right. What schools did you all go to in the Detroit area? You represent Detroit well. Uh, what schools did you all attend? I went to Renaissance High School. Okay, no wonder. My daughter Kamara went there. And so did our, her husband. Uh, so, where did you go? I went to Inkster High School. Inkster? Yes, sir. Tough school. Mm, more or less, not that bad. I used to hang out around there, it was then. All right, and what do you say to this, sir? Uh, well, it happened in August. Uh, it wasn't quite like she said. We were drunk, and I sat on the hood of her car. I did, didn't it? Um, and then it didn't become a problem until like February. Why did uh, you sit on the hood and do all that? I mean, because he well, don't have a car, angster. so he don't care. Angster. Yeah, she could say that, but I was. Inkster. Nah, because I'm from Detroit, so it didn't really have nothing to do with Inkster. <laughs> with Inkster High, outside in the parking lot, getting high and sitting on the hood. Okay, yeah, I can go with that. Thank you. That. <laughs> <laughs> you were there. I don't know if we were drunk or not, but I feel like that doesn't really matter as it's your responsibility. I mean, yeah, actually, what happened? I was in my car. I agree, In my totally. car, and he's outside of the car, decides to. No, she was outside with me. And you have no legal defense to this, sir? 
Oh, uh, mm. the only thing about that was that happened because, like I said, it happened in August, and we didn't really start talking about the car seriously until like February. Okay. Uh, at that point, we had kind of stopped dating, fell out a couple of times. The biggest issue between me and Jordan is that I was still messing with my ex-girlfriend while I was still messing with her. And they had conversations back and forth. Jordan would reach out to her. She would reach out to Jordan. I would hear different sides of the story. So then February happens. At that time, I'm still messing with my ex-girlfriend at the time. Uh, and Jordan, that's when she starts to talk about the car because I guess her lease goes in a couple of months. I can tell you right now, Renaissance women, they don't play that. <laughs> you need to go to another high school and get you another sister. If well, you I mean, it worked for a few games. months. Am I, I mean, right like or wrong? Zilla, then I, we're Where'd you go, there, young lady? Renaissance, Renaissance thank you. They <laughs> don't play with you. Me, you better texting go me. back to Inkster High or <laughs> what's that, Wayne Memorial around the corner or Romulus High or somewhere other than Renaissance. <laughs> they ain't playing. <laughs> What's you all? Well, you all a lot younger than my daughter, it appears. But uh, she's an alumnus. She's a lawyer now, entertainment lawyer. She went to Michigan State, uh, which is a great school. Yeah. I highly recommend Michigan State. All right, judgment for the plaintiff. He has no legal defense, and I have a promissory note. Good luck, Inkster. All right, Renaissance High. All right, have a good day. I mean, don't run your friendships being trash. <laughs> okay. I mean, I can go with whatever she said. Whatever she says is right. That's what Jordan likes. <laughs> and what Jordan likes, Jordan gets. 